Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. Well, here's the Easter forecast. Things looking good uh, for the day. Might be a little cool in the morning. Temperatures in the 40s. Not too bad. Partly cloudy skies. And uh, we should be good in the morning, but later in the day, expecting some uh, a few showers, isolated showers. But we'll see. That forecast may change a little bit over the weekend, so stay tuned for updates. Today, we're going for warm temperatures again. It's going to be cloudy, and we're going to have some scattered showers, but temperatures will still rise to the upper 70s. We're already in the 60s. And then upper 50s on Saturday, close to 60 degrees, not bad, 68 on Sunday. That'll be very nice. 51 on Monday, 72 Tuesday. Temperatures are just jumping all over the place. It's that time of year. It's Hampton Roads. I think we're used to it. So uh, get ready for today being a warm day. Here it is. We're in this warm zone, if you will, uh, south of the warm front, east of the cold front. This cold front will eventually make it in, but that's not going to happen until later in the day. So right now, we're in the upper 60s in Newport News in Norfolk, 66 in Portsmouth, 66 in Virginia Beach. Nice mild temperatures. We've got 67 in Hampton, Suffolk, upper 60s in Williamsburg, 65 degrees in Chesapeake. Now for rain, so far we're fine. There's no rain out there. A couple of spotty showers up towards the northern neck. And we'll get a couple of these spotty showers later this morning, probably in the next hour or two, uh, a few of the spotty showers. But then a bigger area of rain will come in later this morning, probably between about 7 a.m. and uh, 10 a.m., and it's not going to be a washout, though, today. There'll just be a few passing showers from time to time. So uh, we're looking pretty good overall, especially with the warmer temperatures. So here it is noon. Yes, we get some scattered showers. There'll be maybe a break in there for a little bit, but then more showers coming in, in the late afternoon, early evening. This is probably going to be our best bet for the rain as a cold front comes in. And then, well, after 7 o'clock tonight, we dry out. And we'll have some dry weather for the overnight and dry weather for tomorrow. Matter of fact, Saturday, we got a lot of sunshine out there. Temperatures will be cooler. We'll be in the upper 50s to low 60s, but still, I mean, uh, pretty nice day. Remember, the average high temperature is 62 degrees, so we're only a little bit below average for tomorrow, a couple degrees. Now, I'm going with a high pollen forecast for trees, and the reason is because uh, even though we're going to get some scattered showers, to, to wash the pollen out, you need a long period of time with the rain. We're not going to get that today. Uh, we'll have some passing showers from time to time. The trees love that and the warm temperatures, so I think the pollen's going to stay high. It is up high right now. But uh, tomorrow it'll probably be up again, even with the cool down. So there you go. Now, we're at 75 today for our temperature. Killable Hills, 80 in Currituck, Elizabeth City, Hertford, 81. But upper 70s in Virginia Beach, Norfolk, Portsmouth, Chesapeake, 79, 78, Suffolk. Scattered showers, warm and breezy. You got those southwest winds, 10 to 15 miles an hour, gust to 25. So on the eastern shore, you know, the winds over the water, probably some upper 60s around Cape Charles, low 70s in Melfa, and then 77, though, for Hampton, 78 Newport News and Gloucester, 80 for Williamsburg. So at least the temperatures are still warm today. Boating forecast. Small craft advisories are up due to those winds. Seas 4 to 5 feet. Look at that bay temperature, 50 degrees. Those water temperatures are finally starting to come up now because we've had some warm air temperatures. So that's kind of interesting. It's not warm yet, but they're coming up. Saturday, 59, partly cloudy. Sunday for Easter, again, maybe a stray shower late in the day, 68 degrees, partly cloudy. And then Monday, some rain with a high of 51, but then we're back to 72 degrees on Tuesday. Again, bouncing temperatures in the next week. 